Well, well, well. I have made it home, folks. I am the Living Room Panner, and welcome to my living room, everybody. I'm glad to see y'all. I hope y'all glad to see me. I appreciate each and every one of y'all stopping by and checking out my content and enjoying my fun and games. So let's get this ball rolling. All right, first thing off, YouTube is in no way sponsoring, endorsing, or having anything to do with this, affiliated or none of that good stuff. This is all me. All right, the next thing is I would like to uh, tell y'all how much I appreciate y'all being a good listener. Uh, that's one good thing about making a video, man. Y'all listen really well. I had a uh, little bit of uh, situations today. It was a what I call a ticked off Tuesday today. And uh, uh, I, I'm not even going to go into it. I'm trying to relax and calm down this evening now that I'm home. And uh, uh, I'm not going to mention the fact that the uh, traffic jam I was in this morning when I finally got up to where the, they had it all closed down to one lane. Uh, there were about a dozen guys standing around shooting the shit and not really working. And I thought to myself, well, I wish I could have got this on my YouTube video. That had been a real good point. I know here in the Houston area, it seems like you got five guys standing watching while one guy's actually working when it comes to a construction zone. I don't know what it is about these state workers, but man, uh, it takes five of them to supervise and one of them to actually do the work, and that's pretty typical, so... It's a slow process, man. It takes a long time when there's only one person working. So, I won't go into that a whole lot, but I will also touch base with the uh, social distancing deal. That kind of ticked me off a little later on in the morning. I had to make, actually, three different runs today, and every one of them that I went to, I went to a tool supply house, I went to a Harbor Freight, and I went to Lowe's, and man, every one of them, there were about half the people that didn't have a mask, didn't seem to give a care in the world about what was going on, had no problem walking right up on you, getting all in your space, you know. And folks, I said it before and I say it again, back up, get out of my space. And folks, I'm sorry, but sometimes you just got to be a little bit tough on people. And people look at you like they're crazy, you know, like, why, why why, are you telling me to back up? I'm not sick. Hey, did you get a test this morning? I haven't gotten a test, period, so I don't even know if I'm sick. So don't be stupid, you know. Just stay your distance. Keep away. Wear a damn mask, man. As long as this, uh, there's people out there that are, that are still socializing and and just living life every day and not having a care in the world, this thing is never, they're never going to get a handle on it. It's always going to be cropping up and until they come up with a, uh, a uh, what do you call it? A, 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 they figure a cure out for it, you know? So anyways, really ticked me off people getting all up in my space even at work one of my guys came up and got right next to me and I was like jumping out of the way and he's like what's the matter with you and I said man don't you know we're trying to practice social distancing anyways enough about all that I think I I think what's really really got me today is it's been probably since weekend before last since I've done any gold panning and folks I give gold away in every one of my giveaways. And I got plenty of gold, but I like to find gold. I love to pan gold. I love seeing it at the end of my, my pan. So you know what? This evening, come hell or high water, I'm going to do a little panning. My daughter and my grandson are here, and hey, you know what? Hey, I'm doing what I need to do. I need to pan some dirt. I need to play with some dirt. I need to get some dirt under my fingernails, and I need to get my pan wet, and I need to clean some cons. So, folks, I'm going to clean me some cons this evening. But for right now, we're going to do some giveaways, and it is time to give away. Who wants some free stuff? Or, well, maybe not free, but if you donate to my channel, 
I really appreciate it. It helps me. It helps keep this going. I mean, I put the money right back into it and, and I order stuff. Uh, I'm really missing my local coin shop. You know, they won't sell me anything except bullion, and they'd never have it in stock. The last few days I tried calling, they have nothing in inventory. So uh, I've been having to buy online a little bit here and there just to keep these games and stuff going. So I hope you all enjoy these prizes, and I do appreciate each and every one of you all support, participation, and just being there. Just hitting the like button. Hey, that means the world, you know. I'm not crazy about subs. That's not what it's all about. It's about having a good time, enjoying what you do, and sharing a little bit, you know? And I feel like I give back more than most people give. So I'm happy with that. So let's let's give some stuff away. This is what I do best right now. All right, the first thing we got is a semi-mini donation giveaway. It's a $2 per spot. Prizes are pretty much the same. Uh, first place, a point twenty two gold flakes. Second place, a one-tenth ounce silver round. Uh, third place is 2.10 grams of silver shot. Fourth place is a silver quarter and a rosy dime. And fifth place is 15 random wheats. In this go-around, I got Trudy T, Justin P, Shane H, um, Cat Lee, AU Family, Oh, uh, let's see who else. And that's it on this round. But look at all these folks that that donated and it kept it going. So I've got credits for Shane Eight for the next next mini. Trudy T had two two dollars rollover. S. Robbins she got four dollars. John Scott's got six. Matthew's Treasures got eight. Justin P's got ten. And Perry B's got 10, and he likes the same number. So here we go, folks. Let's do a giveaway. Here's all the chips. Will, I know Will Hornbuckle, he's the one who commented. He said he wants to see them chips. And, folks, I understand that. I, I know when I'm, I'm on other people's giveaways and they're doing a drawing, it's nice to see the coins or chips or whatever going into the bag. It's just, it's not that... Y'all don't trust me, or Will don't trust me, or I don't trust whoever I'm seeing doing it. It's just a satisfaction in knowing all 20 of the coins are there, and they're in the bag, they're going in. So it's it kind of, I'm going to start doing this again. I, I know it's a pain in the butt, and it takes a few seconds to do it, but I'll do it just one time per video. For example, tonight i got more than one giveaway we're going to do, but I'm just going to take them out one time. So y'all saw all 20 of the chips, and here we go. We're fixing to draw some winners, so good luck, everybody. All right, who's going to get the gold tonight? Blue chip number 20, Cat Lee. Cat Lee's got the gold. All right, Cat, you already got some in your package. Now you got another little something-something. Congratulations there, Cat. All right, for the one-tenth ounce silver round. Green chip number six. Cat Lee again. All right, Cat, that's the way to do it. And I know you ain't got one of those little one tenths, so I know you'll be happy to have that. All right, here we go. Third place for the 2.10 grams of silver shot. Number 19. 19 is Justin P. You got third place. All right, Justin, congratulations, brother. All righty, here we go. And I hope everybody's got their packages now by lap from a, a week ago Monday. All right, fourth place is number seven. That's for the silver quarter and number uh, Rosie Dom. AU family got fourth place right there. Congratulations, John. You got yourself some silver there. All right, so here we go for the fifth place. This is for the Wheaties. Shane, you in there? Yeah, you're on the list, Shane. Here comes your pennies, brother. Let's see what we can do. Blue chip number four. Trudy T. Trudy T don't want them pennies, so we're scratching her. And she's going to roll them over to somebody else. So here we go. I know Shane's wanting them, Trudy. All right. Number three. There he is. <laughs> Shane, you got yourself another little sack of Wheaties, brother. 
Thanks to Trudy. Thank you so much for that, Trudy. I'm sure Shane, he loves you, man. That's awesome. That is awesome. All right. Well, Trudy, I hope you got your package today, or at least some of them. I know you're saying you're missing a few. So let's keep going, folks. I rolled all these names right here over. Let me zoom in a little bit better. All these folks is on this next list, and here it is. We're going to draw some more winners. And it's pretty close to the same deal. This time around, first place is .21 gold flakes. Second place is one-tenth silver round. Third place is two grams of silver shot. Fourth place is two rosy dimes. And fifth place is 15 Wheaties. All right, folks, and on this list, donators, we got John Scott, Trudy T, Justin P, Shane H, Matt's Treasures, uh, S. Robbins, um, that looks like that's about it. And Perry B, you're rolling over to the next new one with your five numbers that you like. So here we go, folks. Let's keep on giving. Let's see who's going to get that gold this time. Trudy, I know you're ready, girl. You're due. I got a package for you, and it's only got one pack of gold in it. So we need to build your package up. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. First chip. Number four, number four, Shane H. First place, Shane. Man, you old rascal, you stole that gold from Trudy again. All right, well, congratulations, Shane. Sorry, Trudy. All right, here we go for the 10th ounce silver round. Number one, John Scott. Second place, brother, you got yourself that t one tenth silver round, John. Add that to your package. All right, here we go. Third place for the two grams of silver shot. Number 17, S. Robbins, third place. Congratulations, girl. You got yourself some silver shot. You'll enjoy that if you don't have any. These are big chunky chunks, too. All right, fourth place for the two rosy dimes. Number 18, Max Treasures, fourth place. Congratulations, Matt. All right, brother. Here we go for the 15 wheats. Is it going to be Shane H again? Let's see who's going to be. Number 14, John Scott. John, I believe he'll take them pennies. He got nothing better to do other than look through pennies and play with a little bit of gold. So there it is, folks. There's your winners on this here mini donation giveaway. And again, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. And uh, congratulations to the winner and Miss Trudy. I'm so sorry you missed out on this one. And Justin P, looks like you missed out on this round too, brother. But hey, you'll hit them. That, you guys, very consistent. Y'all play a lot. You win a lot. And let me tell you, it shows after two weeks, y'all's packages, some of them are really big. So, all right. I already kicked off another one this evening. I got the uh, mini donation giveaway. First place is the .20 gold flakes. Second place is one tenth silver round. Third place is two grams of silver shot. Fourth place is a 57 quarter. And fifth place is 15 random Wheaties. And so far, I just got Perry B on the list. And I bet you this thing sells out before I go to bed. All right. Now, let's continue on the, down the page. Turn the page. All right, here we go. Now, what do we got here, folks? The big time donation giveaway. It's a $10 donation per number. First place is a .82 gold flakes. Second place is a .40 gold flakes. Third place is another little baggie of one and a half ounces of Lynch Mining Reserve pay dirt. And fourth place is a one ounce silver round, the Indian head. And fifth place is that one ounce silver bar with a Nevada on it. And this go around for this big time deal. I got Max Treasures, Cat Lee, Trudy T, S. Robbins, Scott Jarvie, uh, Ron F. That was donated by me. I gave him the last spot. Uh, uh, Shane H., Matt T., John Scott's on there. Uh, Will H. is on there. Cat Lee's on there. Uh, who am I missing? Looks like I got everybody, and I got nobody rolled over for a new one. So I am I have started a new one. I got another one ready right here. 
So if anybody wants to get in on this next one, I do have a new $2 and $10 donation giveaway ready to go. So here we go, folks. Let's give some gold away now, man, the shiny stuff. All right, this is the one everybody's waiting on. Good luck, Will. I hope you hit, brother, because you ain't been on my channel in a while, so you need some be some beginner's luck, second beginner's luck. Here we go. All right, first place, number eight. Number eight, Shane eight. Shane eight stole the show again, you old rascal you. Man, I tell you what, Shane, you are on fire today. All right, here we go. That was part of the point eight two gold flakes. Second place is a point four zero gold flakes, and who's it gonna be this time? Number nineteen, nineteen, Matt's treasure. Second place. Congratulations, Matt. All right, now for the Lynch Mining Reserve, the one and a half ounces. All right, here we go, folks. White chip number thirteen. 13, it's Shane H. again, stealing the show, man. I'm going to tell you what, you're sweeping it, man. All right, well, that's the way it goes sometimes, folks. All right, good luck there. On the one-ounce silver round, this is that Indian head for fourth place. Number three, Trudy T. Trudy, you want that silver round? I'm going to go ahead and hold that for you, because that may be something you might want. So I'm not going to redraw for that one. Trudy may say, yeah, I'll take that silver round. If she doesn't, I'll add it into the next one, and it'll be prize number six on the next go-around. All right, here we go for the one-ounce silver bar, the Nevada one. And I know Robbins wants this one, so good luck, Robbins. Number 12, Will H. Will H. Pulled one out, bro. There you go, Will. All right, my man. That was awesome. All right, folks. Well, uh, Robbins, I'm so sorry about that, not getting that Nevada bar. I know you wanted that, but, you know, that's the way it goes. We all win some and lose some, and, hey, that happens. So I appreciate each and every one of y'all. If there's anybody who would like to get in on one of these, there's my Gmail, and y'all just look me up, and y'all know the routine. Well, this video's gone on longer than normal, so let me... Wrap this up and tell y'all again, thank you so much. I appreciate it and look forward to this weekend. We're going to have a little free giveaway going on. So y'all stay tuned and, and uh, pay attention. Uh, I'm going to set some clues out here in the next couple of days. So y'all need to be listening. All right, folks. Well, you know what we say. Uh, here, here, here at uh, living room, uh, the pan, uh, the living room of the panner. It is uh, no longer ticked off Tuesday. It is now panning dirt Tuesday, so later taters.